and it has view of the CRT. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. And then I have a light bulb on the buffer lines. Let's sit down and enjoy Super Mario Bros. Cool that I got the CRT in the same frame so that cause so that I can still see the LED. Because I have my NES completely taken apart and what's holding the camera up is the cartridge slot. For the NES, because I couldn't find anything else that would hold it up. So yeah. It's really cool that every time there's a screen transition, the NES looks at the cartridge for where it's supposed to go next through that line and turns like and turns the lines off and out, and the cartridge like tells the NES what to do with the lines to get it to do the reaction for it. Which is so cool. I'm going to study this recording later to see what the light bulb does when what happens. I'm especially excited to see what the vine transition looks like. Man, this is so cool to see what's happening behind the scenes with the NES. so interesting to see what happens on that data line. It's so cool like to see what happens when it loads the maps and stuff for what it's supposed to appear. Like, it only blinks when it is loading a, a new map or screen. Or something like that. And it doesn't seem to blink at all when I press buttons. And I'm glad I didn't accidentally press the rig, uh, press the, like, move the LED on accident when I was moving around the camera rig to record it in the screen. I didn't even mean to record the screen, but I did.
been probing around the NES with that light bulb to see what hooking it up to different things does. And sometimes it lights up, but when it lights up, it like completely disables part of something and then like the thing, the graphics glitch out entirely and it crashes. Let's see what happens in the wrong warp. I wonder what this would look like in a wall play for Super Mario Bros. Well, I'm only doing warps. Uh, warps to warp four and warp eight. Oh well. Cool. That was my playthrough for the right room. I didn't end up beating the game. Oh, I'm just looking at the camera now and seeing what it looks like on there. Kinda hilarious.